Good morning guys. The model you are seeing here is the sample that is going to be done in this tutorial series. We shall see and learn all the tools required for creating this model. Today topic is opening of files in Tecla. Double click on the icon to open the Tecla software. Sometimes a dialog box pops up indicating you to sign in to Trimble Connect. It's optional, close the dialog box. Now you see two buttons. The button at the bottom is for educational purpose and the top is for internal server license. Let us begin with educational license. Select the button and click OK. You get an opening page indicating you to choose the environment, role and configuration. Here the configuration indicates the license. Here it is default as education. Select the configurations and all the buttons and click OK to move to the next window. For internal server license, type in the server name and click on OK button. Tecla prompts to choose the environment. Select the desired environment from the drop down. You can also download from the link shown above. Select the desired role to work with the model. Configuration tells about the license details. Steel detailing consists of all the features activated. For now, let me choose one and click on OK button. Recent file consists of the recent model that has been opened using this software. Below are the list of the model opened previously. In all models, list models from indicates the location of the model that are previously opened. You can also manually navigate through the folders. Below are the list of models that has been opened and the top right corner indicates the configuration you have chosen earlier. Shared models indicates you to sign in to Trimble Connect. Click on sign in to log in to your account. Fill in the details and sign in if you have the account. Once signed in, you will get a window indicating you to continue through the shared models. Click on continue to open the list of all the models that is stored in Trimble Connect. Now you get a window showing the list of all the files stored in your account. Select the model and click on join button to download and work on the model. To create a new model, click on new tab and type in the model name. Place indicates where it should be placed. You can click on browse and choose the location. You could choose whether the model to be created as single or multi user. After selecting all the options, click on create to create the model. To open an existing model, select all the models tab and click on browse button and navigate through the folder and select the folder and click on select folder button. Tecla auto opens the model from the folder and you can see a screen like shown here. Click on the right arrow to open the view. Sometimes the window is black without any grid. Click on the view and press Ctrl A. Then click on the properties pan on the right side. You could see the grid has been selected on the pan. Now change the color of the grid by clicking the color palette. Select the color and click modify to apply the changes. To change the background press Ctrl plus C. Navigate to the model view and in background color change the RGB color and click apply and ok to apply the changes. Let me demonstrate by changing the background to white and show you how it's done. Press Ctrl plus E. Now on background color Copy the RGB code for white and paste on the values 
and click apply and okay now click on the view and press control plus i to open the view list close all the list and reopen to apply the changes now try for yourself changing the background and grid color to open the model as multi user select the model from the list and click the drop down near open button and select multi user to open as multi user and vice versa to open as single user model now opening the model using db1 file copy the desired db1 file in a folder make sure the db1 file and the model folder is of the same name now copy the path of the folder and open in tecla in file menu click open browse and navigate to the folder and click select folder button to open the model and on the view list click on right arrow to open the views note we have pasted only the db1 file to a model folder tecla auto generates all the support documents into that folder custom documents can be pasted here to get that features also thus we have seen all the format of opening a document in tecla thank you guys and stay tuned for more videos